So you have a new 8 inch Dobsonian and now what? I will show you the most important things you have to do right away with this Dobsonian. Let's go outside. You want to use these butterfly screws. They are M4 and they have 35 millimeters. You also want to use a good paint. You don't want a cheap paint because it will peel off and then it will fall on the mirror. So a Bondex, it's a good one. Dad, no! What? The wind! Hold on, just a minute. Oh no, what an idiot. I told you! Well, at the end we did it. This may happen if you don't point the telescope down. So you want to make sure that you point the telescope down in order to work with the gravity and not against the gravity. You will change the three screws one at a time for a new screw until you got all the three screws. Another important mod is the dust cap for, you guess what, protect from the dust. Mine is always placed. The fan works well even with the cap on. Now the protection for the tube and the primary mirror. Every time you point at Zenit or you lose the balance of the telescope and the base of the telescope where is the primary mirror bumps against the rocker it will introduce vibrations, hard vibrations, that could make you lose collimation. With a bit of stiff foam and duct tape, you can make a good protection. A very nice upgrade to the default finder is the Rossi finder. Right angle correct image. It will be a comfort for your neck and also to see the correct image through the finder. Up and down, left and right will be corrected. Now this is the most important upgrade from the 5, to me. The handles. With the handles you can lift all the setup or if you have difficulty in doing that, only the rocker. So it's very handy and useful to grab the telescope and place it anywhere. All the materials used in this video We'll have the links at the description. And forget the Telra that you see in the image, because this is for another video. I don't like the way it is now, and I have a plan to place it where it should be. Stay tuned to, to watch that video. Give it a like! If you like Dobsonians, you may want to click in that video that shows now on the screen and tell me what modifications you did to your Dobsonian telescope.